Hello, YouTube. Let me say good afternoon to all my friends in YouTube world. I think it's about time we got us a, a new pair of shoes. We've been over here working today. We usually mow on Mondays, but we had to mow today because it rained all day yesterday. But we've been working in that garden. That's some of the best water I ever drank right there in a bottle for sure. But uh, we're fixing to show you the garden, what we've been up to today. We'll show you them onions. They're looking pretty good. We've been eating them jokers too. This row of potatoes right here, we healed it up the best we could, but we don't know what happened to it unless, uh, unless when it rained, it flooded a little bit in here and killed them off. I don't know, but uh, this row jumped right out of the ground, looking good. <clears throat> we tried to work in beans a little bit. I think we're going to have to replant the beans. That's Half Runner and Kentucky Wonder. And uh, right in here, we got them Vidalia onions. Got a row of them down through there. be them jokers right there and they're not doing anything right now so I don't know we got a nice row of red beets growing and they're looking good we're not gonna mess with them but uh, we got in here and got as much of the weeds out of it as I could that's one thing about raising a garden they do not discriminate they don't care who you are male or female Black, white, or yellow, they do not care. They will grow in your garden. And as you can see, we like to heal everything up that we can. Everything but the onions. And we want to keep the weeds out. God forbid that an old timer would come by here and see this garden. And there would be a weed in it. But we got about... Uh, we got about 70 tomato plants, I think. Got some cabbage and uh, broccoli, grown, or not broccoli, but uh, Brussels sprouts. Got the pepper plants healed up. and Got a few more cabbage right here. And that's, a, that's four different tomato plants right there. I actually forget the name of them. We're not worried about that. We're just worried about getting something to eat. We don't care what the tomato is, we'll put it in a jar some way, we'll make something out of it. Lasagna is looking good. I've had that seed for probably uh, 12 years, maybe longer. I know you want to see the sweet potatoes. They are looking good. We will come through here. <coughs> And kind of heal the sweet potatoes up a little bit. That's just, uh, you don't have to do it, but we like to do it. It helps keep the weeds down until uh, we can get uh, keep a little better control of it. But there's one that's uh, struggling a little bit, but uh, I think it's going to be okay. Right there. And we did lose one here. We're going to replant that one. And we've lost one down here on the end. We're going to replant it. But uh, we got a few more rows of beans in here. That we planted the other day. We're waiting on them to come up. We've got some cucumbers. We've got some leaf lettuce. And we got that kushaw planted right there. Real quick, let's go over here. You've seen that right here. Now this, this onion is the Texas Star. And I don't know if it's been too wet. 
These are two new ones. The Vidalia and the Texas Star are supposed to be a huge onion and they're a good keeper. That's what I was told and uh, we want some onions we can keep in the cool room. Garlic. I think I'm going to have to talk to Mark about this garlic. I don't know a whole lot about garlic. I'm just going by uh, what Bumblebee Junction says. But the garlic is looking good as far as I'm concerned. Got some more sweet potatoes right up in here. And uh, like I told you before, they look like they're just going to lay down and die on you. You think they're going to just kill over. But they'll snap out of it. Real quick, here's that raised bed. And you can see we got some onions. And we got some beets in here. We're going to try them. And uh, we still got room for some other stuff. We put uh, three slips in here. I can't remember what I planted here, but as soon as it comes up, we'll find out and uh, got some Kenny back growing, looking good. Right here is one of the best weed killers that you can get, 100% all natural. All right, now, we're going to say God bless to you and have a great evening. Always thanks for coming by the channel and watching the video. We do appreciate it. Let's kind of show you our garden. It's a small one, but uh, looking good. Anybody that's raising a garden knows they got to get out there and work that garden, work that ground a little bit. Tell you what, we're going to go back over here and sit down and drink our water. And kind of enjoy the this, uh, this, this afternoon a little bit. Thanks again for coming by and watching. We'll catch you in the next one.